You're watching Greater Brockton. Mark Lindy, your host, and today I have a new face to Greater Brockton, but we know his music and we know his work. His name is Eric Eric Lindgren. Lindy Lindgren. <laughs> hey, I'm sure we're related. There you go. Yeah. Eric, um, you're a musician. That's right. You're a producer. Mm -hmm. um, and one of your works is being premiered at this event. The event is Symphony Spirituals, correct? Symphonic Spirituals. Symphonic, okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. But you have produced a, a piece called Extreme Spirituals, correct? That's right. Okay, that's exciting. First of all, it's one of the most colorful flyers I've seen Thank advertising you. events. So it gets your attention. I've seen it <laughs> at the supermarket. I've seen it around the Great. city. Um, let's whet everybody's appetite to bring them there to this event because we do some coverage of the event, but you, you can't experience live music unless you're there and it's Gotta live. Be there. You can you're right. watch it on TV, you can hear it on the radio, but there's something different about it. So lure them there. How's that? I'll do my best. <laughs> it's pretty easy to do. Uh, we actually have a world-class performer coming up from Atlanta, and I'm not sure uh, if the Brockton Symphony has ever had a, a world-class performer coming up. He's basically at the top of his game, his name is Oral Moses, and he does live up to that name. Mm -hmm. uh, he is one of the most prominent singers of African-American spirituals, probably in the world. Uh, I know uh, Oral very, very well, and for about 30 years we've been best of friends. I've also produced uh, five of his solo CDs, mm -hmm. and he's, just to let you know, one of his websites is www.AfricanAmericanSpirituals. Dot com. Okay. So you know if you have that site, <laughs> oh, you gave it to you me better, in the email, you and it's it's it's, you it's great. It. Yeah. But I mean, world class performer in Brockton. That yes. is a wonderful thing. Mm -hmm. uh, I believe the hall, the the Christ Congregational Church, is 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 a nice place to perform music. We cover the symphony yeah. there. We cover the Jubilate Chorale there. Sometimes we go there for the pipe organ mm -hmm. music concerts sure. and whatever. Um, it has a good capacity. Yeah. And you can't beat the price. I mean... It, <sighs> that would be barely a parking ticket in Boston. $20 mm -hmm. for a uh, uh, just a general admission ticket. And also seniors and students are 15. And if you're 18, you get in for free. I mean, oh, okay. you just can't beat that at all. No, you can't beat that at all. So, um, about how long is the performance? About 90 minutes, 60 minutes? It something? starts about 3 o'clock. Yeah. There's an intermission in it. And uh, there's a first half that'll be maybe 45 minutes, mm -hmm. 50 minutes, then a nice intermission, and then there's a second half. Okay. Um, and I'll give a little plug uh, just so people have an idea of what's going on. The uh, Brockton Symphony is going to start off with the Zampa Overture, and that's a piece by Harold. And that's going to be a maybe seven, eight minute piece, mm -hmm. and it's going to be very, very lively. Uh, after that, um, I'm a primarily a composer too. Okay. Uh, I was commissioned by the Georgia Symphony Orchestra back in 2012, and I was commissioned to write a 25 minute work, which had Oral Moses as the soloist. Mm -hmm. um, he sings with them. And I composed a piece called Extreme Spirituals. Okay. Um, it's very familiar melodies. Uh, there's going to be Joshua Fit the Battle of Jericho. There's going to be Sometimes I Feel Like a Motherless Child. Uh, I'm a Roland. Mm -hmm. uh, so there's five spirituals plus an opening prelude called Middle Passage. And it's for full orchestra and bass baritone. And I always like to say that uh, Oral Moses, who is, again, world-class singer, He's going to definitely make the walls come tumbling down. Oh well, that's great. Yep. Um, and it's a it's a good time frame. And three o'clock on a Sunday. Yeah. It's after the different churches are out mm -hmm. already. Yeah. And there's certainly the clientele in the area for this. I think you're going to get yep. people. Well, the symphony is regional. It, it's the Brockton Symphony. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But you get people from Sharon, you get people from Foxborough, yeah. you get yeah. people from all around, and it's right on the edge of Brockton on Eastern Stoughton Line. So right, it's on Pleasant Street, west of 24. He's easy to find. Um, what will you be doing the day of? Well, I'm also the concert manager uh, for maybe eight or nine years. I've been one of the board members of the Brockton Symphony. 
and it's a real jewel of an organization. And uh, I've offered to uh, be the manager for the concert. So I'll be making sure that everything happens, that Dr. Moses uh, gets his flowers when he's all done performing, make sure there's enough tables. And uh, it's kind of fun for me to do. But uh, it's, it's a fantastic organization. I, I just can't stress how, how good it is. And everyone on the board really, really uh, uh, takes responsibility, does things. And uh, it's it's a wonderful organization. It's, it's a, all volunteer. I all mean, the, the, volunteer. The, the yeah. board members are all volunteers. They don't receive nope, compensation. Nope. No the one money receives compensation. That is paid in goes out for yeah. the programs and to pay the musicians. Yeah. Right. Well, actually, a lot of the musicians have donated their time to really uh, being familiar with the organization. Um, it, it's everyone is passionate about it, and even the uh, you know, for instance, they might bring in a cellist and. Uh, uh, you know, uh, more string players. I think that might be one of the areas that they have to hire people. But I know that, uh, like Wayne King and the brass section, they're they're as good as you know anyone from the BSO, from my point of view. Uh, they've got wonderful woodwinds. Torben Hansen is the clarinet player. Yes, and he's the chair of the orchestra. Just a, a wonderful individual. Mark Finkelstein, he's uh, the, the chair oboist. Mm -hmm. uh, Susan Kaplan, I don't know how the organization could exist without her. She just does everything. So a lot of the people involved in the board are also members of the symphony. So they you know, put that extra effort into uh, really making it work. Many hats. And also the thing that I admire a lot about the organization is when you bring in young men and women, yeah, um, who, absolutely. some of which are superstars or are definitely on their way to yeah. a stellar career going forward. Um, there's, you have a lot of corporate support from Harvard One. Yeah, Harvard One's been um, great. I know Ken Feinberg in the sure. past has been a big supporter of the organization. So, and you guys space the concerts out around the year, so there's mm -hmm. a nice calendar. Everybody loves the holiday yeah. pops, but yeah. this is different. It's nice to see something new. Yeah, this is, you know, um, being a composer, you know, I like challenging music. Uh, why I've called this work Extreme Spirituals is, interestingly, spirituals were always an a cappella art form. It was just sung. And again, you know, there's a horrific period in our American uh, history, you know, where we had slavery and, and, and that. Um, so, you know, these these enslaved African Americans, they would sing. Now, they never had accompaniment. It was all done vocally. So, uh, you know, here, these spirituals, they have a full orchestral arrangement. And I've, I've done some twists with them. You know, it's not your traditional arrangement. Uh, composers like Harry T. Burley or Hall Johnson, they were known for creating what we associate with the instrumental accompaniment for spirituals. Well, we're glad to help you promote it. Yeah. We're going to be there, but we Great. want you to be there. So just to Absolutely. recap, it's Sunday, April 23rd, 3 o'clock, Christ Congregational Church, Symphonic Spirituals. Be there. Thank, Thank you. you, Eric. Thank you very much for your Appreciate time. Appreciate you coming on. You're watching Greater Brockton. Mark Lindy, your host. Stay tuned for more events, places, people, and faces right here in the City of Champions.